I just finished Undertale, like finished, finished Undertale. I'm not a fanboy type of guy. Uh, I hold allegiance to no company or no anything, but probably my favorite game of all time. Uh, the last game I can remember being that emotionally invested in would be Final Fantasy 3 on Super Nintendo and I was a lot younger. Uh, now we have to do Genocide Run and kill everyone though. Ugh. We're having pee pee tacos for lunch. You don't know that. Right oh. before I turned on the camera I said, I'm gonna try to think of something interesting to say. And what came out of my mouth was, we're having pee pee tacos for lunch. But we are, pulled pork tacos. How do you know? You said with, maybe. Made with authentic pee. Yeah. And then what are we doing? We're going to go walk around at a lake. And take pictures? What are we going to take pictures of? What's our master plan? The beautiful environment around us. So you're wanting me to take your picture. Aww. Alright guys, welcome to the headphones unboxing video. We got Meg here. She's ready to unbox her Audio Technica M50X headphones. Make sure you leave a comment, You're like, and comment, knife, and subscribe. For comment, knife, and subscribe. This is super hard to do left handed. It's like it's going to cut your face. Oh, wait, don't get bloody. Cut towards your pudding. That's exactly right. Ah. Dang! Dang! Dang. <laughs> Back at it again. The white headphones. <laughs> Oh, Dang! 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 Done! <gasps> Whoa! Woo! They look so good. Take the plastic off the damn cups and let's see them on your I'm head. Put them on my head space. Ooh. They're so white. I, that's Gosh. what I wanted. Let's see these bad boys. Oh, they look awesome. You're gonna love them. <laughs> Act like you're playing out last. Yeah. <laughs> that's exactly right. Just concern. It's a general look of concern. Room. This freaking battery is almost dead already. Uh oh. What? I knew it. <laughs> this is where they hid the body. You ready? Yes. What am I ready for? Woo! <laughs> <laughs> oh god. Nature. Do you think someone has like a pet fish in here? Okay, we're taking this really quick to say that I didn't charge any batteries and I own four batteries and I didn't charge even one of them and the battery's probably gonna die before I finish this. No black nominees thing has happened at least 71 other times. <laughs> okay? I have to document this because I can't believe it, but I just got in my car after being at work all day and my car door was unlocked and my car keys were sitting in the seat where I had, I guess, dropped them on my way out of the car this morning. They were in plain view. Oops. So I left my camera here at home all day today. So there goes one seventh of my time to vlog during the week. So I'll have to remember to vlog about some stuff. But I came up here to get my PS4 uh, because I got to record some Unravel. Hello, Internet, and welcome back to another episode of Yup Plays Unravel. Gotta go to church. Here I go. There I go. I don't know if it's possible, but this week I felt so tired that I don't have anything I want to vlog about. <laughs> so ridiculously tired all week. I need to have more energy. Maybe if I drink all my five hour energies at once. That could work. That could work.
Working at Guitar Center is something that I've always enjoyed, but as soon as I got promoted to warehouse manager, things got a little more frustrating for me. I'm not sure if it's my added responsibilities or the fact that I'm in charge of other people now, but something about my job is inherently more stressful than it was before. I still have fun at work whenever I can, and I do still genuinely enjoy my job most days. I know that whether it's at Guitar Center, YouTube, both, or something else entirely that God has planned for my future, He will give me the skills I need to succeed and be happy. I'm looking forward to the days when I can feel more comfortable and less stressed about my life. I try not to film too much at work because I don't know if you can get in trouble or get fired for that kind of thing. What do you think? If I'm just filming, like I'm filming me doing my job, it's not like I'm doing something wrong. I don't know, but uh, let me know what you think about that in case I get fired. If I got fired, I'd probably just be stoked and go do YouTube forever. Just kidding, I don't make even a one-tenth <laughs> enough to survive. I have been in such a slump about my channel this week, and I've been trying to figure out what it is because the videos are fine. There's nothing wrong. The videos are the same as they always are, I'm, I, but I feel like they're worse. Like, I just feel like my videos are boring and crappy, and I couldn't figure it out why, and I think I figured it out. I have, like, a, so many series going at one time that I don't have time to do little one-off indie, like, fun, just relaxing, whatever I want to play games. So, I think that is what's happening. I think that is what's making me stressed out. I'm not saying I only want to do one-off videos. I'm saying they're important for my mental health. They really are. I start to feel like my channel is just stagnant and not going anywhere and boring. I've got to remember to, to have fun videos too. Mario Maker, you know, just something that no commitment. Uh, and that is exactly what I'm about to do today when I get to my house. Oh! Okay, so up until uh, today, Mario Maker levels and stuff has been a pretty relaxing experience. Uh, I just played one by my dudes in Couch Pals Let's Play. They have a YouTube channel. They made a level and they sent it to me. They didn't make it for me. They just made it and then they sent it to me. Oh my gosh. Approaching Geometry Dash levels of getting pissed off. Oh my god, that was the perfect time. It was perfect. Stupid dusty habit. Hey, Amos. Good puppy. Hello, I am a dog. This is my dog vlog. Welcome to dog vlog episode three. Where are we fitting to go eat? Boo! Hi hop! Hi hop! Oh, I wanted to read you a comment. It's funny, other than all the, when are you playing more Outlast with Megan? <laughs> Decent video until your face camera. Don't need to see your face. It's distracting. <laughs> right? Because you're so good looking. I want I want to see the gameplay, but I don't want to hear you talk or see your face. I just want to. I want to play it myself. I don't want to play. No, no, no. I don't want to play game. it myself. Well, I can really manage to f up anything, can't I? Okay, so let's talk about some stuff while I eat this burnt trash breakfast that I made. <laughs> it crunched so loud. The thing that bothers me in the YouTube comment section are the people who feel the need to correct everyone on everything. And the Undertale community slash fan base is the worst about it. They're even worse than the Five Nights at Freddy's fan base. Yeah, I said it! I said it! If you love Undertale so much, that and you're so passionate about it, why are you trying to ruin the experience for other people. Well, actually, you're wrong about this. You need to know that. Like, there's there's one guy, I'm not gonna tell you who he is, who patrols all of my Undertale series videos just looking for someone to leave something in the comments that he can correct so he can feel cool about himself. I just don't understand. They like to wait, to wait until I do a voice for a character and then tell me, well, actually, that's not the right voice for this character. You can suck it. They don't have voices. I understand that Flowey has a laugh, and uh, Metaton has an oh yeah. Gosh. Going forward, I'm gonna do more Undertale stuff, so anyone who behaves that way in the comments 
is just going to be blocked from the channel. And I almost never block people from the channel. But I'm going to do it because it annoys me that you act the way you do. And I will block you. The way blocks work on YouTube is it's what's called a shadow ban, which means you don't know that you're blocked, but you are. You can leave comments and you'll see them, but nobody else will. If you're one of the people who feels the need to behave that way in the comments, uh, you're going bye-bye. I'm sorry that I had to take your yub privileges away. Why am I so hateful this morning? I don't know. I've been in a sassy mood ever since Thursday on the live stream. I was talking a lot of crap. <laughs> I was talking a whole lot of crap on the live stream. You guys know I'm a nice person, and I almost never speak out against things that bother me. I just let them, let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Anyways, I love you guys. Uh, please hit subscribe down there at the bottom if you want to see more from me. I'm about to go edit this vlog. And as always, have a bye five. Have, have, have a bye five. And as always, have a bye five. <laughs> have a bye five. And as always, hello internet and welcome back to another episode of Yup Plays. Of Yup Plays. Yup, 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 plays. And as always, have a bye bye.